This is lesson 27 of the Virtuoso Method with Colton, and it is March 5th, 2015. And we're going to begin in book four, the folder called Prelude and Song One. So with that, let's, um, let's again just start by working on certain measures. So let's start with measure one by itself. And make sure you count. Good. Measure three. Yeah, one more time on that. Good. Let's do measure two. Again, same measure. Uh -huh. nope. Something's playing on every beat. Let's try it again. You had it right the first time. Good. Let's do it two more times. You're doing it right. I just want you to get some more practice with it. Nice. One more. Nope. Same measure. Measure two. One more. One more time. Good. Let's do the first three measures in a row. Keep it going. Don't stop. Good. Let's try it again and see if you can keep from stopping at any point. Doesn't mean you have to go fast, just try not to stop. Okay. Go for it. That was awesome. That was really good. Let's do that two more times. First three measures. Good. One more time. Let's do measure four. We haven't done that yet. Measure four. Mm -hmm. You got it. Mm -hmm. And they both end on fourth fingers. The last note is a fourth finger in each hand. So that helps. Try it again. Mm -hmm. Good. Try it again. Just jump right in. Good. And again. Just try to keep repeating it as quickly as you can.
Fourth fingers. There you go. Go again. Jump right in. Start again. Good. Again. You just got to keep doing it a few more times. Again. Now, watch your notes. Nope. Again. Try again. And make sure you count loud enough so I can hear you. Okay. A few more times. No. Watch that orange note in your right hand. It's a second finger. Try again. Second finger. You keep playing yellow in your right hand. There's no yellow. So try it again. Uh-huh. Go again. Nope, nope. Not yellow. Good. That was it again. Let's do it three more times. Just like that. Good. Two more. One more. Nice. Let's do the whole first line. That last note. Keep it going, don't stop. Keep going, don't stop. What are those notes? Find them, find those notes, find those notes, find those notes. No. Oh, wait, no okay. What's that last measure again? Let's do it two more times. Uh huh. Let's do it again. I want you to get it right twice in a row. Nope. Twice. In, nope. Watch your starting note. Nope. Nope. What? Nope. Orange. There's no yellow. There's no yellow in that measure. Good. One more time. Just like that. Nope. 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 Let's try the whole first line again. And try not to stop. Ah, no yellow there. Last one. Good. So you got to resist the urge to hit a yellow on that last measure. You got to get to a red in your right hand. Let's do the last measure two more times again. You're going to get it. You're very close. Now just the last measure two more times. Get your starting notes right. Uh -huh. That's it.
Nice. One more like that. Good. Let's try the whole first line again. You're going to get it soon. Maybe this time. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah, watch that. Don't play yellow there. That's what you got to keep from doing. Go ahead, play the last measure twice again. Nope, no yellow. There's no yellow in the last measure. Maybe that's the best way to think of it, is you just can't play yellow anywhere in the last measure. Okay. Go for it. Last measure, twice. Let's get it right twice. Good. One more time. Good. Let's do the whole line again. It's always a new chance to have the first time. Okay. Go for it. You did play a yellow, but at least it wasn't on the first note. Let's try it one more time. What's that last measure? Let's do it two more times. I think you're going to get it this next one. Two more times on that last measure. Good. One more. One more. All right. Let's try it one more time. No yellow notes in that last measure. No yellow notes. Let's try the whole thing one more time. Start the whole first line again. No yellow notes. And by the way, don't speed up. Because when you speed up, you're more than likely going to have to stop somewhere. So just keep it slow all the way through. You have a much better chance. Even if I know some of it you think you know really well, and you probably do, but it's still you don't know all of it really well. So you have to keep it slow. Okay? All right. Let's play line two, the whole line two. Just jump right in. You don't have to think about it. Let's see what happens. Second fingers, second fingers in both hands. Good. 
Let's try lines one and two. All of them. Okay. What's that first note in the left hand? What's that first note in the left hand? There you go. Did you realize you played every note perfect? No. Well, you did. That was awesome. Uh, well, let's do it again, because we still got to get practice. That was great, though. So lines one and two again. What's that? What start again? Start, what's that left hand note? What's that left hand note to start with? OK, here we go. There you go. Go ahead and start over. Go ahead, wait, wait. Go ahead and start over. Just if you mess up too much, it's better just to start over, get a good clean shot again. No worries. What's, what are the notes? What are those notes again? Right there. Nice. Let's do it one more time, both of those lines. And then we'll do something new. That was great. Yeah, one and two again. All of lines one and two. Keep going, don't stop. Ah. Okay, let's do measure nine. Just by itself, measure nine. Together. Almost. Watch those yellow notes. That's it. Let's do it three more times.
have only one note there at the end. Try it again. Okay, let's do the next measure, measure 10. So you haven't done this measure before. And then, so you got to, when your fourth finger plays in your right hand, your fourth finger's playing in your left hand on beat three. So try that again. That's helpful. Try again. Fourth fingers, both fourth fingers right there. Good. Let's do it a few more times. That was it. Good. Two more times. Nope, nope. It's fourth fingers, fourth fingers at the same time. Uh -huh. Fourth fingers, fourth fingers. Good, one more time. All right, now let's do measures 9 and 10 together. Let's do that two more times. Those two measures. Nice. One more. And notice, wait, wait, notice that the last note in measure nine is a red note, and it's the first note to start measure ten. So all I have to do is pick up that finger in the right hand. Let's try it again, one more time. Mm-hmm. Okay. Start again, measure nine. Nice. Now let's do measure 11 and notice that both hands start on the fifth finger. So there's another pattern for you. Makes that easier. Okay. Measure 11. Starting on fifth finger. Just measure 11. Just measure 11. Fifth fingers. They both start on fifth fingers. Just automatically go to the fifth finger. Uh huh. No. Nope. Had it right the first time. No. Nope. And look at the right hand is going. Play the play just the right hand. Play just the right hand. In that measure. Starts with the fifth finger. Do you see how it's just going in order of your fingers? Five, four, three? Do you see that? Okay. So now let's put both hands together. Measure 11. Mm -hmm. 
together. No, you got to go five, four, three. Five, four, three in the right hand. Go again. Good. That was much better. Try it again. Five over three. Good. Try it again. Together. No. Different, different than the left hand. Almost getting it right. You're very close. Okay, here we go. Together. Got to play together on that one. Okay, again. That was it. That was it. So let's do that right a couple more times. Good. Again. Five, four, three in the right hand. Mm -hmm. Good. Let's do it one more time. I want I wanted to see you do it twice in a row. Correct. That's what I'm looking for. No, no, no. Try again. I want it twice in a row. You see if you can do that. Just think about it. No. No. Try again. Try again. So make it a goal to do it twice in a row. No. Think about what you're doing. There's one. Let's see if you can get another one. No. Five, four, three in the right hand. You're just going down in single steps. Try again. That was it. Now let's see if you can get one more following that one. That was it. All right. Let's do all of line three now. That was good. You're getting very near to the end. You've almost done every measure. Okay. All of line three. Different note in the right hand. Different note in the right hand. Five, four, three. Try that measure again. Try that third measure and keep. Try that third measure again. No. Nope. Try it again. Third measure. There you go. Try third measure again. No. Nope. No. Nope. Good. Let's try the whole third line again now. So you got to watch out for that third measure. It's the hard one.
fingers notes, both fifth fingers. Keep going. Nice. Let's do that one more time. That was so much better. One more time on the third line. Doing great. Fourth fingers, fourth fingers. Good. Let's do the whole song from the beginning to the end. You can do it. What's that first note, the left hand? What's that first note? Different notes, different notes. All right, hang on a second, hang on a second. Try again from the beginning. Because I want, I think if you get it right to begin with, then you have a better chance of carrying that through all the way. Don't put too much pressure on yourself. Just relax. Okay. Okay. What are those notes? What are those notes? What are those notes to start the measure? You got it. Get your notes, get your notes right, get your notes right, get your notes right, starting notes right, get your starting notes right on that measure. Right-hand right note is yellow. Very good. So you played it through for the first time. And we hadn't even practiced those last three measures. Not bad at all. So my guess is that in the next lesson, you're going to be able to perfect this. Because you basically have it all down now. And I think just sleeping on it one more time 
you're going to have it. So that's really good work because it's, it's challenging. And this is a way more difficult song than something like Mary Had a Little Lamb. It's like not even in the same league. I would say 10 or more times more difficult. So really, really good. Uh, so let's leave it at that with Virtuoso Lesson 27 with Colton on March 5th, 2015.